Hello everyone, welcome to the channel and here we are in the Deathproof channel and in today's video we're gonna showcase some more World Boss Legends and it's time for Mephisto and his challenges he have you have to have uh, uh, some characters here like Sentry to clear that it's a native tier 3 so it's quite, quite expensive but you're using already I guess Sentry as a PvP character, so you can use his leadership easily because it's a debuff immunity, so it helps a lot with uh, Mephisto. And I'm gonna show you the teams I use to progress through stage 34, which is hero female. So you can see there is quite few characters you could use, there is not, you know, a lot of options, but uh, still, you know, one of the best characters is Makari, Luna and Saron Rogers. Of course, there's characters like uh, Silk, you could do that, but uh, I find that it's way easier with Makari, Luna and Saron. And I'm gonna show you a video that uh, I cleared with uh, three separate teams, one of the teams was uh, Saron Rogers with Wanda leadership and it's the stage 34 uh, where you can use Wanda as a leadership you can use Valkyr also and you can use the as main DPS Saron Rogers the team was that and the other team was in stage 39 with Sentry as a leadership and the leadership Sentry I used Luna and Fox, cause you could use both of them, they got the leadership ability and the other team was Makari, yes this team Makari with Icarus as leadership and Cersei as a support I already record that it's quite hard to do, you know, when you're uh, when you're recording a video, you need to do a lot of uh, restarts. And here is the run how it went with Sauron. In this specific battle here and this record, I choose to put a record that I managed not to win. And what I'm talking about, I'm gonna explain to you. Uh, it's a run that I didn't end up winning the fight, but I was so close and I was really enjoy the fight. I was like <laughs> almost having a heart attack there. And I want to share you the moments there I felt in this video. It was really close, but I'm not gonna let you see and so you can understand and appreciate the feeling. Here you can see in 45 seconds without triggering the raids, the raid phase, I managed to pull out all the damage and went through the first phase with Sauron and now I was uh, walking around here to save myself from the fires and as you can see I'm using as many as characters with fire resist I could and yes there is not a lot of characters for that at least for female there is some but for with leadership ability I don't feel like there is a lot it's very few you know and here I managed to pass through the raids, then raids and hit some, like five to six bars. I didn't, I wasn't doing quite good management of the damage for sure with Saron. I could do it even faster because you can see I'm here in one minute and 30 seconds and I'm ending the second phase. So you're imagining like see he gonna do it like with one minute left. But uh, yes, I'm taking you the hype, but uh, I really remember what happened in this phase and in the last phase basically. And it was kind of funny, you know, here I was like, okay, I'm gonna lose the character, let's swap. And I swapped into Wanta to take this uh, attack, you know, with these purple things, it's hard to, with Sauron to go and hit the tier 3 and save yourself, so I was like, no, I'm not gonna, I'm gonna, I'm not gonna waste my Sauron here, I'm gonna save here. But uh, I feel, I felt like that was a mistake from one side, from the one point of view, you know. And here I didn't press the third skill, I thought I did, and I missed it. <laughs> it was my bad also. So yes, there is no Venom here to have him and heal. 
So yes, I missed the tier 3 and I was trying to save it to be sure, but I managed to do that. Here I could go and use the third skill also and accumulate some damage. Here the accumulation wasn't that great, but you can see it's really hard if you have less than normal HP, it's really hard to stay alive. And here I thought, you know what, let's try to DPS with Wanda. I swapped to here also because of these purple things. And here I said, yes, we're gonna end up that run here with uh, this tier 3, but no, the accumulation wasn't that great also. And here I get stunned over and over and over and over and over again. And Wanda and Wanda got a CTP of rage. I could DPS with her also all this time, and I could save myself some time and be able to clear the boss easy peasy. But uh, no, that wasn't the case. And I think that also here I was on 22% peers. And I'm not showing you the characters right now, cause uh, I'm gonna show you in the in the end of the run, just to realize what build they have and how easy or hard is to do that stuff here. I didn't had a really good place with Sharon, but I loved all the how the all the the run end up being, so that's why I'm showcasing this video. As I told you in the start, of course, but in case you. <laughs> You skip the start and want just to see the end of the fight. Yes, I'm saying it again. It's not the best fight I could do. I, I was using for stage 34, 35, also Makari and Luna. It's way easier for me than Saron. But Saron got the huge EOE, the huge tier 3 that uh, is disgusting. The damage is huge. So, yes. It's really easy if you manage to pull out good tier 3s with some here I get stunned. Yes, yes, I was really unlucky sometimes. You are here. I was like, yes, end, end. But no, it was 8 seconds left and I was like, okay, okay, I need, I need to damage, I need to damage and I turned up using Valkyr. But no, I lost it. It was like... Okay, I'm not gonna try again. And then I tried with Makari and clear it fast. And this is the Luna run. I run up with Luna as I told you because you need to use Sentry as leadership. And Sentry's leadership is quite cool because you are getting dispelled from the fires. And you can see Luna with uh, the build I've got on here. She's able to clear state 39 easy peasy. As you can see, I'm just spamming the skills, yes, I could uh, consider that uh, spamming the skills is, uh, you know, uh, building the raid outburst faster, but I was like, okay, okay, I have the damage, I could raid outburst and run with sentry. I was running into sentry, cause sentry got really big speed and he's running around the map really fast, so yes. That was the deal, that's why I was swapping into him to do the runs. And you can see in 4 minutes I already did the outburst and it's 1 minute left and he is like 57, 57 seconds left. So yes, um, I was able to turn him into the next phase. And the good thing with uh, Luna is that she got his, her own heal so even if you take a lot of damage and you're like with uh, pff, really low hp you can here i understand that i fast swapped before the raid outburst and i start dpsing with pvp sentry just to trigger the raid outburst and go faster into that into that running around you know and yes let's see what luna gonna be able to pull out with 21 bars I'm close, I'm close. Mm, yes, yes, let me... Okay, okay, a tier 3 here was... Uh, okay, I was close to die, but you can see the damage of the tier 3 is insane, guys. It's insane, you know? Here, tier 3 can pull out a lot of damage with my build. I'm gonna show you what kind of CTP I'm using on Luna or Obelisk, on Sauron and... 
on Makari also, yes, Makari end up being one of my best characters for cleaning Mephisto and now C is pretty solid, I've stacked up here with Odin's Blessing but I'm, I'm letting you, I'm letting you see the builds in the end to be more specific, you know how he's able to do stage 39 of Mephisto with these characters, I'm trying and I can't do that I'm gonna show you why <laughs> my account after Black Friday is pretty beefed up always it was like medium beef up but now I was like 16%, 19%, 22% pierce for a long time but now with 25% being capped on uh, pierce I feel like god you know <laughs> I feel like it's more than it's all on my skill what uh, I'm gonna able to pull out you know before I was failing on clearing stage 39 let's say and I was like yes it's that because I wasn't uh, I wasn't Copped on uh, Pierce. I have only 22. I have only 19. But now there's no excuse. So I want to progress through the runs and go more uh, as I could. More than stage 40. More than stage 50. Stage 99 is my, you know, the wh where I want to end up as soon as possible. So that's why daily I now I'm doing the talent stages with Sendry and. This team specific I'm using for that to progress through stage 39 and be able to unlock it at the end. I'm not sure if I'm gonna be able to pull out 100 seconds, but uh, you know, paying for 100 seconds instead of paying 100 seconds and sentry runs, it's really big deal, you know. If you can clear it that with the car the specific character you need to. It's really cool, you know, you only gonna end up paying like 100 or 200 crystals and getting some Garandine uh, loot boxes there from uh, from the talent reward and the first clear reward of the stage 40 and being able to progress through more stages and use more characters in World Boss Legend. And that's why I'm, uh, I am I really love World Boss Legend because there is a progress, you're using new characters and here I wasn't swapping, <laughs> I used here to end up and you can see 40 seconds left, stage 39, so C is, seems to be way better than Sauron when with Sauron I wasn't able to clear stage 34, okay it was my bad swapping so much to Wanda but still you can see Luna's damage is pretty solid with my build, that's why I'm telling you yes here is the first time I cleared with Sentry and yes it was pretty big deal to me and here it's the run with Makari 3 cancel, 4 cancel, 2 cancel, 1 cancel, 6 cancel, 5 and easy peasy damage is there you can really canceling everything except 5th skill you're canceling immediately every single skill I'm holding a bit the third skill sometimes because the other skills are not ready <laughs> But uh, there is no way, there is no point, you know, you need to cancel a specific skills. Even the Waken skill, even the pff, every single skill, it's cancelable. Except the fifth skill that you want to play until the end, because there is a lot of hits there. You can see, there is a cross into the character. A cross, when the character is into that cross, you don't want to cancel his skill. And you can see, 59, 49 seconds here for uh, you know swap, swapping into the next phase of course she got more support than Luna cause Luna had Sentry's leadership where Sentry you need to get the debuff to get 30% all attack uh, instead of uh, uh, Icarus that giving you 60% all attack to all Eternals as you know but uh, White Fox had a CTP of Insight and here Cersei or Icarus don't have any CTP of Insight they are you know no CTP characters for me I'm using them I'm using C uh, Cersei only for his support and Icarus for his leadership for Makari of course there's no other character you could use them but yes there is other characters for PvP like Gilgamesh and Thena seems to be really cool I was ignoring here but as it seems 
I need to start, uh, you know, collecting the universal books and go for here also. See, seems to be metaphor ABX. I saw a lot of people doing 10.5, 10 million. So I want to give here a shot. I'm going to build here just to try here if she can be able to pull out more than Wanda. But uh, that's going to take some time. <laughs> At the moment I have here rank 4, I think. I don't have tickets to go to... Okay, here I was uh, like, I thought I'm gonna die and that's why I swapped into Cersei. I missed the third skill there. And yes, I swapped into Makari again to do the damage I should. But Makari, you can see, it's I can't use here because she was assisting as a striker there. And here, as you know, six bars. It's stage 39. It's really cool for Makari and yes four here five yes four cancel two cancel one five you're letting your fifth skill place a bit and yes okay 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 the fifth skill again okay again I thought I'm gonna die that's why I swapped into Cersei every single time in this stage I have died a lot of times in the purple things uh, you know, seems easy to avoid, but sometimes the game is ignoring your uh, what you want to do. And here I was risking it. I said, yes, let's go to do a tier 3, and I lost some time. I thought I could be able to clear it faster, you know, do all the damage, but at the end I realized I can't. And I swapped into Cersei to push a bit with the proc. But you know, she got only a Nobelisk, and that's seems to be unable to do good damage with my bad rotation also and you can see here Makari is struggling without the Waken that's why I wait a bit for the Waken and hit this last rotation I think yes one minute left one minute and six seconds left with my Makari she seems to be the best the MVP versus uh, pff, the character Mephisto, the uh, the world boss legend Mephisto, and let me show you the builds I have now. I have then and now. I haven't really swapped anything on the characters, and yes, uh, pretty much. Sharon Rogers got a mighty energy on here, a CTP of a mighty CTP of energy with two hundred proc, I think, and six percent peers. But uh, let me show you the. Uh, Yes, let me show you the build. As you can see, she is not cap on crit, but she's getting a, a buff, a berserker buff on her fourth or her fifth. Yes, or her fifth. Oh no, where is it? Yes, on her fifth skill. So it's like you are capped. I've got like four, uh, one, two, three, four, five Odin's Blessing on here. And yes, you can see the build. It's pretty straightforward. Uh, oh, it's five peers. Okay, 200 proc, but five peers. Everything mythic here, I think, also. Yes. Oh, except Xavier, but doesn't really matter with the dots there. And my Luna is pretty beefed up. She's missing some critical damage and some critical rates. She got no buffs through her skills. And I've got here uniform mythic. You can see all the options here are mythic except this one. It's legendary. Okay, I'm not gonna spend to go that. And here is the surprise. CTP of Judgment for Luna. No artifacts. Uh, type advantage. It's 5. The enhancement. And you can see she's beefed up with Odin Blessing. 2, 5, and 5, 10, and 4... 14 on this blessing guys 56,000 energy attack and here is my Makari and yes 51,000 physical attacks is capped on everything a bit critical damage missing she got like 3 6 9 12 all this blessing 13 all this blessing yes 13 all this blessing she's beefed up also like Luna see here typing it's full and uh, yes, she also got the artifact, the passive ability that giving you 10% more, but she's not mythic here uniform at least at the moment. Oh, I could do that. Let's do that. <laughs> Why not? Oh, I'm missing that one. Yes, that's a one of the materials 
I recently end up having less. I thought I never gonna end up, but as it seems, you need some of them. Let's open up some loot boxes I already took from World Boss Legend and some dailies. And yes, guys, Makari is the MVP versus Mephisto, at least for leadership ability and as a female character. I feel like female hero, at least, you know, perhaps Moonstone, but still. She is MVP for World Boss Legend, at least Mephisto, 100%, because uh, she is a speed type, she gets a type advantage, okay, that's bad. But Phoenix Feeders, but I always need them to craft, but yes, still, you don't want to have that. <laughs> and let's see here, I think I've got, I could take one of these, yes, let's open up that also. And yes, that's for me, guys, I hope I make you smile, oh, Professor X, nice. <laughs> and I hope I help you decide what, to, how to build the characters you want to build, and so you... Uh, you know the new ones I haven't uh, progressed through to build to show you something else than Hela. Of course, I could show you some Sif in World Boss Legend and what's the difference between having her or not as a support. But at the moment, I was feeling like I want to show you the progress through Mephisto with my cards being like that. You know, recently I did 25% pierce, as you can see. And uh, yes, I'm missing the physical attack proc, so you have to consider that the run was without the physical attack proc from the White Fox card here. I'm I was struggling to do that, but I wasn't able, and I had this seven quality there, and it's pretty same to roll it. I'm gonna I'm gonna try in the future, of course. That's for me, guys. I'm out. I hope I, you liked the video. S drop a like, comment, and subscribe, and see you in the next. Bye bye to everyone.